How are we leaving with a yard that's completely level and a kitty cat in our yard? I don't know. 18 hour drive to go. Nova Scotia to Ontario. For the last three years, we have filmed almost everything through the ups and the downs from where it all began in our van to the massive project of renovating our abandoned cabin. And this week, we are planning to go somewhere new and take you along with us. One hour to the airport. And an hour until we see the gals that make you smile. Get yourself some friends who don't just talk about it, they do it. Euro trip for the girls. So excited to see their faces. In this very moment, we had no idea that we weren't going to film this trip. But we put the camera down, and this is what happened. This is Talon Mads, our dear friends. The four of us met in Mexico and made a pact to visit a new pride parade each year together. We hopped across the ocean to the Netherlands where we celebrated in the European streets with over 400,000 others. The city was alive with love and community. This Euro trip couldn't end without some sunshine. So naturally, we landed on the beautiful island of Havar in Croatia. This place was the relaxing getaway our bodies needed, with a healthy dose of the sea and pasta. Each day, we tackled the white stone stairs as the Croatians do, stopped to pat the local pups, and enjoyed every moment being present with our friends. It's the moments like these that remind us happiness is sweetest when shared. While the moments in Europe became memories, we happily reunited with our gals, squeezed in time with family, and zipped on back home to our little cabin in the vast woods. We're home. Home, sweet home. Home, sweet cabin. Feels so good to be back. So good to be back in the woods. It's so quiet. I feel like we're yelling. I know. That we're really not. Oh, well, first. Hmm? What first? I'm gonna finish this. I know it's first. And I'm gonna make, you're going to the greenhouse. I'm checking out the blue skin. <laughs> Do you think it stayed? Is it holding up? I think, I think it's good. Is it a success? I believe it's a success. Yes! Everything's had time to settle while we were gone. I think it's a good thing that we actually left and took a little bit of a break yeah. because the ground was able to settle. Now it's ready for topsoil, it's ready for grass. The blue skin is sticking so we know that in later dates, mm nothing's gonna go wrong normally we just go 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 kind of like this we're learning not a few things to do around here eh? <laughs> <laughs> been thinking about these plants and this greenhouse for ever every single day they're on my mind look at this tomato plant it's as tall as me almost look at it. just wait till you see these plants they are thriving <laughs> Everything is so happy. I've never seen a parsley this big, the sage, all the herbs, the basil. Oh my gosh, it's screaming pesto. It's so beautiful. Wow, the kale is ready to be eaten. The green onions, oh my gosh, everything is so, so alive. I could not be happier coming back to this beautiful, thriving greenhouse. Look at this parsley. This is so big. <laughs> Let me tell you, we are going to have a delicious home-cooked meal today. I don't think we've ate a home-cooked meal in 18 days because we've been away from the cabin for 18 days, everyone. Uh-oh. It's not uh-oh. The aphids. They already know. The aphids are back. They bug me, those things. <laughs> aphids or aphids or whatever the heck they are. I'm gonna go literally get some tape right now and take them off. Chris is annoyed right now. <laughs> I'm annoyed. But guess what, y'all? Thank you to all of your comments in our real life tour. We just ordered 500 ladybugs. Let us know if that's enough or if we need to order more. Are you ready to eat? I've been waiting for this moment. Look at this. Oh my goodness, it's almost filled in. Oh our hard work, it's coming to life. Jack and the Beanstalk. It's so pretty. It tastes so good. Look at this guy. Beans galore. Oh, look at this one. <laughs> it's a cookie van. So sure of anything. 
Our first tomatoes. <laughs> tomatoes are a 10 out of 10. Good job, Gardner. I can't tell you how excited we are to see our gardens producing and thriving at the homestead for really the first time ever. It's very exciting to be able to walk through here, especially with clear eyes. After taking a step back and being away for about 18 days, which is wild to think, so much has changed. Everything looks so different. Everything is fully grown in. Sometimes taking a step back is so special because walking back into this space looks and feels so different. It's so exciting. Every little detail, every little plant, every little tomato, such a good feeling. We love the cabin so much and it feels so good to have somewhere that is truly, truly home and to miss so much. <laughs> like I never thought I would love a place as much as I love this land. It's home. Who I'm most excited to see? Clementine. <laughs> I missed you. Oh no. That's a sign. I've done, done, Where did it done. go? Where did summer go? Summer I didn't even come, I girl. I can't believe it. Summer didn't even come. We really didn't get it in Nova Scotia. Oh my gosh, there's three leaves. It's not a fluke, there's a few. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no. Fall is pretty, so don't think I'm not gonna fall, y'all. I just didn't fall. get summer. Thankfully, we had it in Croatia. Yeah, I miss those 34 <laughs> degree weather. Hot days. Coffee and crystal. Is yeah, you happy to be home? I love it. Are you happy? Do you love it? I love it. I love it. You're so perfect. Yep, Yay, right Bella! I'm right in the middle. <laughs> oh, love you, Bella. Bella. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love my cabin. I love my cabin. Well, well, well. Oh, shall we change the attire? Did I ever miss these? But it's... The sun has come out to play. So have we. Izzy's been spending the last 18 days with her grandma. You've been in there for an hour. I wanna go back and live with my grandma. She gives me all the treats in the world. I gained three pounds while with grandma. What are you doing, dog? Let's go, come on. Wanna go for a run? Ooh, yeah, you see I'm only superhuman. Let the day and go into the moon, man. Blast off, blast off. Yeah, you see my true plan. Spreading joy, feeling new, yeah. Show it up with my pants. Mailbox was overflowing. Thanks, neighbors. Oh, Izzy, you're locked in. Go swimming, Izzy. Go for swim. Go swimming. This thing was a gift when we moved first here to the cabin and we were doing all kinds of trimming and brush cutting and chainsawing to tame back the land. Wow, well, we've done a heck of a lot of that. As you can see behind me, this is our beautiful, beautiful long driveway that I love so much. But like I said earlier, taking a step back certainly does give you a new set of eyes and Larry was right. This driveway needs some trimming. Sorry, Larry. Sorry, Larry. Larry's our dump truck driver and our friend and his truck is quite big and quite tall. And when you come down, it's starting to scratch on the limbs. So let's cut some limbs. Let's cut some limbs. Get out of my way. You've got some mighty long limbs here to be trimmed. Thanks for coming out, limb trimmer. Anytime, I'm always around. <laughs> <laughs> this is Yes, that limb trimmer told me to tell you my story. My favorite memories traveling abroad were the ones where I was finally able to communicate with the locals. I was 17, I was living in Spain as a nanny, and my Spanish was finally starting to work. This was an incredible feeling, and it's changed my travels ever since. I've been able to make friends with the locals, communicate effectively when ordering or trying to get places, help others, but most importantly, travel confidently to off the beaten path places. Y con toda la buena vibra. ¿Y cuántos días hasta acá? 
A huge thank you to our partner, Rosetta Stone. Rosetta Stone prepares you for real life conversations with real people. From your very first lesson, you will learn practical phrases that you can put to use. You will not be memorizing translations. Instead, you will learn naturally with Rosetta Stone's immersion approach. Lessons are less than 10 minutes and you can do them from anywhere in the world or in between classes or on breaks from your phone as the app is top notch. Rosetta Stone is offering you a lifetime subscription. No renewal fees. It is a one and done. You will have access to all languages for life and it's at a 50% discount for our viewers. You can use the link in the description to access a whole bunch of languages, Japanese, Dutch, Spanish, and the list goes on. Almost a trabajar. Yes, that limb trimmer is telling us in Spanish to get to work. Oh my God, the camera's not even getting it. We. It's tall, eh, folks? I think you already needed that tall, girl. Nah, I've done this before. Say <coughs> my first rodeo. This has been a pie in the butt for our pal Larry. It's time for us to get to the root of the problem. I guess we've been beating around the bush as it's already September. You've used that thing once or twice, eh? Jasmine's turn. I'm going out on a limb here and I'm gonna say this is giving a whole new meaning to living in the sticks. We good? See, the cabin looks so cute from here because of the archway. Yeah, well we cut it to be like circular so when you're walking down the driveway you can see the gorgeous little cabin underneath the trees. Do you see it? <laughs> Clean up time! Oh! <laughs> Look at it. Next chore. This is equally as exciting as getting my first lawnmower. <laughs> if y'all remember that. This is my first lawnmower. I'm proud. <laughs> what? what method do you have? I don't know, but I've never done this before. <laughs> Turns out when you leave your cabin, you come back to it a lot of work. You haven't done this before? No, never. You've laid a metal roof, but you haven't used a weed walker? No. Only crystal. We Up on weed whacking. Never gonna get the weed whacker out of her hand. She's absolutely obsessed with it. I was gonna say, as you can tell, I'm having fun because you just have been going. I have been having real fun. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna make a path, baby. Let's see it. Crystal just said, I'm only gonna do the fruit tree path and then I'm done. Guilty. Are you still going? I have these. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> Here you go. Thank you. And here you go. Every job starts with Clementine. Oh my darling. Oh my darling. Oh my darling. Leave it to the professionals, right? No, Tyler and Todd, no. We are professionals. <laughs> So proud of Clementine for starting up first try. We just left her for a while. What a gem. She is a machine though, so makes sense. We're about to build stairs again. Last year, we liked her. We built those beautiful stairs and we even made the stringers homemade. This is incredibly wrong. Oh. I don't get this at all. How do you do stairs? However, our deck allows us to buy these stringers. Things should go much more snippety quick than last time. It's a very awkward way to walk up right now. This rock has been coming in handy for the two of us, but anytime we have any guests, you know, the over uh, 50 year olds, ain't so fun for them. They don't like it. They're telling us to get more railings, they're telling us to get more stairs, and they're right. Maybe we should make it a bit wider than this. Why? Maybe it's nice two people can walk up and walk up the stairs, you know? Can you look at this first before you just decide? Yeah, like that's a normal amount of stairs. You want like enough that two people can walk up, nice. Or like groceries and stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, I, think, I think this is an idea, like this is just a side step. Like, yeah, it's, not, it's like three feet long. It's hmm. very small. Look at this. This is what you have going on right now. I'm 5'6", girl. 5'6". Let's do it. We're gonna use these all the time. We're gonna be parking here and bringing the groceries up. No. I will be. I'll be using the front entrance. 
Four feet, five, six, same thing. Now time to bring in some stone. That's it! That's nothing! I didn't really get a lot, there's just one more stringer left. <laughs> you think that's fine? Yeah. It's just one more stringer, right? <laughs> so I've got more? Stringer delivery? Put it on, girl. I just delivered you a stringer. Go ahead. Where's the delivery package? Wow, the garden's look pretty. Oh my goodness. See, I don't need that much material, that little load. It might look funny, but it's all we need. I hope. It's one shovel. I just ran inside to get a battery, and it looks like someone's still on the European cultural siesta time. What the heck, girl? Okay, Belle. What are you doing, lady? Sleeping. We're not having olives on the ocean anymore. We're back in Canada, North America. I'll take them all. What? I'll take some all. <laughs> I know how to get you up. Start the tractor. <laughs> I knew that would get you up. Why are you so sleepy? I don't know. You want to be back on the European time zone? The European chillin? The siesta naps. Uh. <laughs> that we prioritize sitting on a patio, eating olives, drinking wine. Um. You like that lifestyle, eh? Yeah. I can't believe how fast these are leveled. Can you? And the stringers are already cut. What a wonderful thing. I actually like making stringers there. I know. Because someone didn't put them on the charger. Remember that? Who's that? I don't know. My AP apprentice. <laughs> You gotta go to work so you don't fall asleep, eh? Yeah. Is that what you said, I'm up? <laughs> you look so funny right now. It's just like the tractor in the background with the solar, you're just like true farmer girl that's so tired. Look at those eyes. Look at those eyes, she's so tired. No. Go to bed. I don't wanna. Okay. <laughs> what are you using there? A stair hanger. <laughs> I love these things. How many did I buy? I was like, I'm gonna build a bunch of stairs this summer. So we have lots of stairs. Hangers. You Isn't should tell it? everyone when we woke up this morning, we weren't planning on building stairs, but here we are building stairs. I was planning on building stairs. You are prepared. I was planning on building stairs. Oh. Whole day. I didn't know that. I've been wanting to build stairs all... Why do you think I bought these stringers? Uh, Why do you think I bought <laughs> these? Why do you think I bought these? <laughs> I got more stringers coming. We're building stairs everywhere, girl. Over there, over there. Oh Why are you just laughing over there? <laughs> <laughs> I learned last year that these hangers take a lot of <clears throat> nails, 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 nails. Holy smokes. Come on! <laughs> yes! So what did I do this year? Well, screws, 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 screws. Okay, Crystal won't allow me to use my screws because she says the head is going to hit the back of the stringer. She's probably right, but I can use the screws on every other point. There's not where it meets like this. See what I'm saying? Like this. It's just a day goodbye and get higher, 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 Oh, it can't be all the way to the top. Why? A step. What? A step. You're putting, we have to know how big our decking board is. It has to go down. <laughs> you know it's been a while building stairs when you forget to account for the step. I say it's pretty good. We figured that out on the first stringer. Imagine we did them all. Building stairs are fun! These are going good too. Right? Yeah, it's so good. Look at them go. It's awesome. It's honestly so easy. With these pre-made stringers. Hey, bada boom, bada bing. No math, no razzle run, this, that, yada, yada, yada. She's strong. <laughs> Last one. Time for a little measure twice and make sure it's perfect. And then decking board time. Oh my gosh, go. That's all. <laughs> Why thank you, Clementine? Anyone ask for a miter saw? I got one question for you, Pac. Can't hear you. Are you ready? We are ready. Let's go. Hammer time. It amazes me. The second time you do something, you just do it so much more faster and efficiently because you've tried the first time. Things just get easier when you keep on trying. I'm happy and I'm impressed. 
I'm absolutely itching to get down these stairs. Long before they were built, actually, and even more now. I'm so, I'm so, so excited. I've been asking guys to go down them for about 10 minutes now. So we're gonna put this camera on the tripod so I can walk down my stairs already. No one's walking down the stairs. Okay. This will be your first reaction, see? Our first reaction. Mm. I can't wait. Oh, Yay! yeah! That is Woo! I love them. Me too. Yay! Yeah, there. Yeah. Why should I? What is this? What the heck? Come on. Come on. She's happy about it. Is he coming? Oh. Is he going the old way? Oh, where is that? You don't like to change up your routine, do you? What do you do? What the heck? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yay! Yay! Good, good. Good. I love it. Woo! Although you had a plan this morning to wake up and build stairs, I didn't. Now I got stairs. Street time for the dogs. Oh my god. Wow, we're using the stairs so good now. Okay. Stay. Stay. Okay, come on! Good girl. How grateful are you to have this space? I love it. And I miss my knives. <laughs> I miss cooking with you. Nothing like a home-cooked meal after being away. All you do is crave your food, eh? Oh, onion, garlic, and ginger. Who knew there was a better combo than onion oh, and garlic? It smells so good. Yeah, good point. Who knew there was a better combo than just onion and garlic? Uh, the ginger. We had a canal dinner date in Amsterdam. The best. The best ramen. The best food I've ever tasted in my life, so we're gonna try here. What do you look at that? New path to the grocery store. Yep. Wow, this is getting better and better. This is so good. Right? Mm. Follow me. Phenomenal. How is it? I this right now. Smells very good. A fresh bag. Told you. <laughs> Behind me right here are our two big projects we're working on simultaneously right now. One, the yard, and two, the siding. However, there are very important steps that we need to do before we can get to the transformation station time, like when you're laying the grass and all that. And it's quite fun. Wish I had friends. I think if we do little bits at a time, it won't be that bad. Okay, hear me out. What if we made this like a game to make it way more fun? And I have an idea. I am going to basically spray paint a checkered board on our yard and we need to pick up this amount of rocks every day before Porter gets back because then we're that much closer to the grand reveal. You have to stick to it. I challenge us. Ready? the most fun ever. You're missing out on a great time. I'm kidding. Got a long ways to go. These are top tier rock pickers here. Go team! This gives a whole new meaning to DIY, but at least we'll be ready for the topsoil and have a beautiful lawn of grass again. We made it to the line. Wow, that actually went a lot faster than I thought. And to be honest, I wasn't crazy about Jasmine's idea about spray painting us a square, but it is motivating because you know where the end is and you want to get there. We did the whole square. I even went out of the boundaries. This task will prepare us for siding. Just need to fire up the paint gun. Got an itchy cheek if you could itch it. Oh my God. <laughs> Please, I want to look at my hand. Sealing the wood and sonar tubes is an aesthetic but important step before the transformative siding install. Looks so good already. Take a look at it from far away. From all of your view. Pretty spiffy, I have to say. Getting me excited for the siding. 
Wow. The whole place is gonna change. We got carried away, potting around the yard. It felt good, just organizing everything. And Crystal even lit the sauna. Is it hot enough? Yeah. It's hot enough. It feels so good to be home at the cabin, to just be settling back into this beautiful, quiet space in the woods. And it did feel so good to go away and literally not film a single thing. Not yes. gonna lie, I struggled with it. It wasn't I, easy. I wanted to film so much, but it was the right decision. Yeah, it felt really good to put it down and just take a step back from everything and come back with fresh eyes like we discussed earlier. We are gonna be here. We'll Having a nice Sunday chatting with all of you. In the comments. Happy Sunday, everyone. Thank you all for watching. See you next week. Love you, Pat. Come here, come here, come here. Run, run, run!